Hey guys, here's another step for the movie poster series. Now that we're much better organized, we want to start making the appropriate changes to our image. But I want to show you something first that I haven't done with my layers or images before that can prove really handy when making changes. I'm going to create a smart object. Smart objects are like Photoshop files within Photoshop files. When they're created, they take your image and store its original data, making it so the changes you make aren't permanent and can be reverted. This becomes extremely useful for an image that involves multiple layers, like Zero here, who right now has two. By the time I'm done with him, he'll have a lot of layers. So, in the Layers panel, highlight both layers, right-click, and press Convert to Smart Object. You'll notice it is now one layer, and you got this little icon in the corner of the image itself. Double-click on that, and you'll get a little box that says Basically, press save in order to save any changes you make once you're done. Press OK. We have our image. It's fully editable. And we have both our layers right here. As I continue to add layers on, when I add effects to him or make changes to his color or contrast, it's important to continue combining these different things into smart objects. That way, you don't get confused with all the multiple layers you're going to be using. So in the next video, we're going to start making the changes that I promised you, and I'm going to show you how adjustment layers allow you to make those changes while sticking to the philosophy of not damaging your image.